Hi, here is Social Innovation Insight, where we inspire individuals and drive change. Have you ever heard of meat made from vegetables? It is not coming from a science fiction story, but from our daily life stories. In fact, nowadays, plant-based meat is not only made from vegetables but incorporated into food technology. The recipe is based on peas, non-genetically modified soybeans, mushrooms, and rice. In some of the most well-known hotels and restaurants in Asia, the UK, and the US, you can find the plant-based menu provided by Green Money. So what is Green Monday and why is it so popular among investors and social entrepreneurs? Actually, Green Monday is an online term coined by eBay in 2007 to describe the best sales day in December, usually the second Monday of December. And this plant-based meat company, Green Monday, is a multifaceted social venture founded in Hong Kong on Earth Day 2012 and is now a global food company. The founder, David Young and his company, advocate for at least one plant-based day per week, engaging all stakeholders to construct a sustainable global ecosystem of future food sources and products. And the plant-based meat is their product that was launched by their food tech company Omni Foods, previously known as Right Treat. They spent two years conducting comprehensive research and created the most famous and the first product named Omni Pork, which has now been expanded to over 30 global regions including mainland China, Singapore, Taiwan, Thailand and the United Kingdom. So how did David discover this business opportunity and what drives him to be so successful? David himself has always been very concerned about topics such as the climate crisis, climate change and etc., and hopes to call on more people to participate in actions to protect the planet. When he read the report, he knew that except for cars and smokestacks and exhaust gas, the truth is, our food poses one of the greatest dangers to the planet and is one of the largest contributors to climate change. The livestock sector is among the biggest contributors to the climate crisis. It emits an estimated 7.1 gigatons of CO2 equivalent per annum, representing 14.5% of all human-induced emissions. Cattle represent 65% of the livestock sector's emissions, holding the title of the species responsible for the most emissions in the world. Also, an estimated 1.29 billion metric tons of waste is produced by the Chinese pork industry each year. In North America, the dead zone in the Gulf of Mexico is an oxygen-depleted ocean caused by nitrogen and phosphorus pollution from the hog industry. David realized that people should eat more vegetables to reduce their dependence on animal husbandry, thereby reducing the damage to the Earth's ecosystem and the environment. However, people's meat-eating habits are unlikely to change in a short time and most are reluctant to change, so David thought of providing people with the option of eating veg meat instead of simply taking away their meat-eating habits. David teamed up with another well-known social innovator in Hong Kong, Francis Ngai, and co-founded Green Monday to develop options for people to eat vegetarian meat so that people can eat it with a meat-eating feeling and be more willing to adopt it, so as to gradually change people's consumption habits and also reduce the risk of certain diseases, including coronary heart disease, diabetes, high blood pressure, certain cancers, and obesity. Green Monday Group is now equipped with food tech, business, investment and advocacy arms, and is designed as a platform to include everyone who is part of the change. Green Monday Holdings consists of Green Common and Omni Foods. Green Common is a plant-based food, retail, distribution, and dining business with a sales network that spreads across more than 10 global regions. Omni Foods is a food tech company with future food innovations including Omni Pork, Omni Pork Luncheon, Omni Pork Strip and Omni Eat. Green Monday Ventures is an impact investment arm that supports the growth of plant-based and alternative meat businesses globally. The Green Monday Foundation works on plant-based advocacy programs that partner with schools, restaurants, and corporations internationally. The mission of plant-based meat is not only to construct a multifaceted global ecosystem of future food that combats climate change, food insecurity, public health crisis, planetary devastation, and animal suffering but also to encourage individuals, communities and businesses to move towards a sustainable, healthy and mindful lifestyle in order to build a future ecosystem of common interests and sustainable development. As a social enterprise, it has the mission to save the earth, and its founder David received the award of Social Entrepreneur of the Year by the Schwab Foundation and the World Economic Forum in 2018 for this recognition. As a company, it has achieved innovative changes. Fortune magazine ranked Green Monday Group Top 32 on its 2020 Change the World list, it's an annual ranking of top businesses that are doing well by doing good. The group's list of recognitions also includes 2019 Company of the Year by PETA Asia, Sustainable Food Influencer by WWFHK, Roddenberry Prize by the Roddenberry Foundation in 2018, and Top 50 Most Innovative Companies in China in 2014 by Fast Company Magazine. 
Green Monday has a big mission, and it also attracts investors who have the same mission to accelerate the transformation of a resilient food system. In 2020, Green Monday raised 70 million US dollars in investment led by TPG's The Rise Fund and Swire Pacific Limited, representing the largest round of its kind to date in Asia. The round also drew new angel investment from renowned artist Wang Lihong, adding to the group's growing list of high-profile backers, including James Cameron, Mary McCartney and Susan Rockefeller. As a food company, food quality is the key to its success. Omni Pork contains zero milligrams of cholesterol and is free from hormones, antibiotics or cruelty, and is 86% lower in saturated fat and 66% lower in calories than real pork. Additionally, it offers a much higher fiber intake, 2.6 times more calcium, and 127% higher levels of iron. The climate and animal-friendly innovation was recognized by PETA Asia and helped its parent company Green Monday earn the prestigious title of Company of the Year 2019. Business can only go further by doing good, which is why venture capitalists are optimistic about business plans with a particular social mission. And do you want to know more about why businesses can mitigate wicked social problems? Check out our earlier insight. We are Social Innovation Insight, with a special focus on social problems, innovation and ideas, social business, design and etc. If you are interested in any of those topics, please contact us. Have a nice day.